Hello everybody, Alexander here, back with more Inscription. So we're picking up right here in the wetlands where we left off. So I did realize um, after I uploaded the last episode to YouTube that it messed with the audio a bit, like post-upload. So I did increase the volume of myself and the game just a little bit to try to see if maybe that helps with it. So here's hoping that it works. And uh, let's get right into it. What do we got here? Ooh. You have arrived at the inky mouth of a cave. A strange beast lurked within. It spoke, pass one of my trials and I will be yours in a raspy voice. Okay. Three creatures will be drawn from your deck. They will decide your success or failure. First, you will choose a trial. Trial of Power. The three drawn cards must have at least four attack power combined to pass. Trial of Blood. The three drawn cards must have at least four blood combined to pass. Okay. Trial of Wisdom. The three drawn cards must have at least three sigils among them to pass. Trial of Power. Let's do it. Yuck. Great White and Grizzly. Hell yeah. You have passed the trial. The beast revealed itself, and it was... Oh. Ah, oh, god dang it. Hold on. Inhabited turkey vulture. Squad. Let's see here. Oh, it's not bad at all, actually. The fact that it takes eight bones is kind of crazy, but... Um, god, I really do, uh need to get a different controller because that is gonna like eventually cause me a super big problem but let's do it we got here hmm the amount of items you can carry is three and you have three okay instead perhaps you'll accept this gift from my friend Akrat, hell yeah okay the prudent pack rat never doubt the utility of a well-stocked pack. I'll take the card. Does that happen every time you roll the backpack? Ooh. I kind of like the trial cave. But that's a totem battle. Hmm. Pick your poison. Alright, let's try our luck. Okay, so all his shit has, uh, thorns, essentially. Think bug, you again. Indeed. Our friend freed me. Well, I basically told him how to do it. You got a plan? We have another friend here. You got... I wouldn't call him a friend. I suppose we are in deep this time, yeah? Okay. Let's see here, what do we got going on? A uh, one-two frog with thorns and reflect on airborne creatures. Stink bug requires two bones. Coral. Uh. Yeah, stoat. Sack squirrel. Play stoat. Back on the board. Yeah, man. Uh. Wait. What are those adders with thorns? That's crazy. I wonder if it procs the de the the what is it the um the instant death thing. Oh, uh, let's draw a card. Turkey vulture, eight bones. What I got over here? The bones jar. Okay. Uh. How do I get, like, an exact count of the bones? I mean, I guess it's just the coins are accurate. There's, what, five there? Okay. Uh, stink bug? I want to know how that works. Okay. Yeah, just move to combat. 
Okay. Let's draw from the deck. A wolf. Okay. Oh. Uh, I do need to know, though. Okay, so yeah, that's crazy. Okay. The, um... Are you kidding me? That's really frustrating. Um... Force him to skip his turn, see if that works. Okay, creepy. Cool. Uh... Let's see here. I don't know if I can win, but I'm going to try. I think he kills me regardless. Yeah. I lose a life. That death touch shit is crazy with the thorns. Interesting. Yeah, I'd hope for more too, buddy. My deck is just kind of lacking right now. And that's fine. Trial of blood. Trial of power. And Trial of Bones. Okay. Trial of Power, because I have a lot of high-power creatures. So there's a decent chance I'm going to pass. Yep. Okay. Wolf Cub. Alpha. And Bat. Do. Hard bearing the Sigil will block an opposing creature... Bearing the Airborne Sigil. Borrower. Bat. I'll take Alpha. Um. Yeah, let's go to the backpack. Because I'm missing some stuff now. Let's grab a squirrel. And let's grab a black goat. Those would have helped a lot in the, uh, the fight against that Thorns BS. Okay. Nice top deck. Yeah, I mean, I guess. I don't know that you count as a top deck, but sure. Gek. And then Squirrel. Into Wolf. I wonder if there's creatures that grant multiple bones for them dying. Frog. Okay. Get rid of the, um... Stump. Man, he really likes the, um... What is it? The adder? Akron? Okay. Um... Squirrel. And then Stoat. Why would I bother keeping you alive? You're not, like, mad useful. Okay. Um... Squirrel into pack rat, right? Yeah. Okay. I want to get rid of the death touch critter. Um, draw from the deck. Freebie, nice. Uh. Let's drop him here. And then swing. Okay. Uh, draw from the deck. 
The Strange, why can't I remember his name? I believe I lost some of my memory in the flash. Oh, so you were put into the card by the camera. It's like this nonsense. Okay. So it stores like people's essence. Uh, drop a card. Alpha. Four bones. Um, yeah, and then move to combat. Cody. Drop from my deck. Turkey Vulture takes eight bones. That thing is crazy. I'm just gonna move to combat. Bullfrog. Okay. Um. Interestingly enough, I can net a bunch of stuff off what I'm about to do. Yeah, because I want like a bunch of extra teeth, right? Like, win or lose, I want a bunch of extra teeth. Oh, I should have looked. I forgot that I could tilt the map up to check. Trapper. Sucks. But I do get an additional card, which is never bad. At Mole. Yeah. And Mantis. Uh... I do kind of want the mole. He is a pretty good blocker. But that cat. Um. Blocker. I do need something to, like, kind of keep me alive. Campfire time? Campfire time. Alright, group of starving survivors. Yep. There is room for a creature around the fire. Power. Yeah. Um, man, part of me wants to roll the dice on it, but I'm not going to. Let's let's try the alpha. If I can make him stronger, that'd be nice. Nice. Okay. I still have the card, right? I do, okay. The 2-2 two, two now. Which is pretty good. Alright. Kinda bullshit we fighting this time. Okay, so he just moves his shit to, like, space over. Alright, what do we got going on here? Kingfisher, Coyote, Kingfisher, okay. Freebie. Squirrel. Pack rat. Freebie. God, that card is... That card's crazy. Move to combat. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and draw from the deck. Wardrobe, he almost put me in there. The top left drawer. But the puzzle was too easy. Interesting. Yeah, that's really interesting, actually. Alright. Uh, let's go ahead and put you here. And move to combat. Such a weird deck. Yeah, possum. Okay. Uh, I am just gonna move to combat. Okay. Get ourselves a new card here. 
alpha uh, elk and the snapper i want the elk pretty good uh two drop Ooh. Does that just let me remove a card from the deck? Let's do the Ritual Stone. Choice is yours. Um... Let's see. The pack that's a pretty good card, though. Um... Let's do the mole, because it doesn't do damage to anybody. Your choice, marvelous. Uh, uh I wandered on the elk actually, that seems crazy. Yeah, so now it has like the move over feature and the movement to go to a space that needs to be blocked. All right, let's do this, man. The mud tugged hard at your feet, forcing you to slow your pace. A rank odor caused your stomach to churn and your eyes to water. It was the rotting fish that hung from the branches around you. A huge man approached. The fisherman. All right, let's do this. Look, there's a third. Talking cards somewhere around here, personally. I hate the guy. Biggest killjoy ever. But he's the only one of us with a plan to get things. Back to normal. What do you mean by normal? Like, what is going on here? Okay, there's, um, there's definitely some, like, soul chicanery going on with the cards. Because, like, it's crazy. Okay. Uh... I'm saving the black goat for his too fast, too soon BS. Unless he doesn't do it. There's only one way to find out, right? Let's do this. Uh, squirrel. What is this? Bird. Okay. Black goat, sack the squirrel, play the goat. Grizzly, sack the goat. Grizzly. And then... Yeah, move to combat. Yeah, he's got a bird. Hmm, stale fish, hard juice. Um... Let's draw the squirrel. Put that there. And then... Pressure fish, easy shoes. Okay. Stoat. New fish, easy shoes. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Okay, let's see if he cheats again. Go fish. Okay, so he didn't cheat again, but what are... Eight buckets, okay. Uh, draw a card. Great white, okay. Man, this deck is not very good. I kinda got unlucky with some of the cards I have. In the sense of, like, I was hoping I would get a little more lucky with some of the stuff I was pulling. Oh. Okay. Cool. Oh man, I am real glad that that's a thing. Oh boy, let me tell you. Um, I'm just gonna move to combat. <laughs> the angler. Find his hook. Play a squirrel or something when he aims it. That will protect your best cards. Yeah, I figured that out without your help, thanks. Um... Uh... 
called. I think I still lose. Um. I don't know. I gotta keep drawing here. Yeah, I don't I don't think I win. The fit that man that shit's crazy. Okay. Oh those buckets are nuts. Hmm. Alright, so do I get like another super card? Is that like the deal here? I need to figure out how deck building works. That's definitely going to be important. Afraid you are not dead yet. Hold still. Okay. Yeah. Camera. Right. That if you really think I would leave the film in there? Do you have any idea what this camera is capable of? Give me that. Okay. Mento to create. Behold your death card. Alright, uh, choose the cost from it. Hmm. So, do I keep my old death card or do I just end up with a new one? Two bones seems okay. Sure, let's try the bones. Time it will be power and health. Obviously the bear. Uh extract the sigils. Mm okay. I like the idea of a card that gives me backpack supplies. Why not, right? Um. Call it Death's Gift, why not, right? Pretty sure that's right. Yeah, I don't I don't know if it'll let me Yeah. Should be right. Well, I must capture your visage. Sure, bud. So my concern is, does that replace my prior super card? Interesting. Those fish buckets are nuts. Are you prepared for what lies ahead? To be impaled on the angler's hook like the one who came before? A gift from the angler. You see, he was defeated recently and wishes to redeem himself. It would be unfortunate if you were to fall to the prospector before he was given that chance. This hook is powerful. You may steal one of my cards with it. For that reason, you will not find any others along this path. Use it wisely. Okay. Uh, it seems the lily stink bug has made its way in. But it, it is dealt so it stands. Okay. Let's go. No, you may not choose a specific beast. Instead, you must now decide on a tribe that you prefer. Birds, elk, 
Bugs. Bugs. Cockroach. Nice. A randomly chosen insect card. Wish for something else. Nope, it's mine. It's a very strong card. It's... An ancient woman emerged from behind an oak tree. She carefully laid out intricate wood carvings, then gestured at them briskly. Okay. Choose. Oh, okay. Uh... Yo, give me the mole totem. You accepted the woodcarver's offering. It is useless without its second half. Who it is? Be the last encounter with her. Okay. I can't use it yet. Okay, he is, he's fish. So I'm just kind of run at him. Can't stop thinking about that wardrobe. The metal sliders, they're... They're a bit like cards, aren't they? Yeah, yeah they are. Uh, I do need to go look at it. But, for right now... What we got going on here? Wolf cub. Alright. Uh, squirrel. Sack the squirrel for the stoked. Back on the board, yep. Oh, that's messed up. Okay, so he just gets it for free anyway. Uh... Okay. Oh... Squirrel. And then wolf. And then... Wolf. Uh, what does the stump have attack? That's fine. Um... Or the boulder. Stink bug. And then we want to drop an Arduck, Bullfrog. Okay. Uh. I'll try like an Adder or something. I just don't have a lot of cards yet. Gotta tilt the scales in my favor here. Uh, a cockroach. That there. Squirrel, put that there, and then attack. Perfect. What's this? Okay. No ifs, it's just the tribal pick thing. Ooh. I don't know what that is, but it looks cool. Adder, nice. Okay, yeah, I'll take it. I like having a creature that can just kill something. The old woodcarver again appeared before you. Okay, shoes. Elk. Wool. It looks like a bird. Bird. The old woman bared her teeth in satisfaction. Your first totem was complete. The borrower sigil will now be marked on all your bird creatures. Interesting. Okay, so that's how that works. Okay. I was wondering if it gave, like, flying and the borrower thing. Hmm.
Probably another sigil battle, why not? Like, even if I lose, it's worth the experience. Okay, so bird creatures get the whole, like, move over thing. Skunk? Let's do. Creature posting this card, lose one power, okay. So, Squirrel, Bullfrog, and then Combat. Eh. Go ahead and draw a Squirrel. Um... Give me the squirrel. And then I want... A little squirrel. Into adder. I kill the bird. Combat. And then the coyote's gonna hit it, but that's fine. Into stoat. Total misplay, what do you mean? It's fine. We're off of my deck. Wolf. Okay. Get them out of here. Play the wolf. Move to combat. Half the tooth. Nice. It's just a shame that I died prior without getting to spend any of the teeth that I had accrued, but that was my own fault for not paying attention. Let's see, bug, howling thing, bird. I want bird. Magpie. Covetous this magpie can fetch any card in your deck. It's a search card? Fuck yeah, okay. I like search cards. <laughs> I really like things that just search for stuff. Form light from the campfire, yep. Reach by the fire, embrace its power. Uh, let's see. Man, uh... I'm gonna... I'm gonna roll the dice on the cockroach, because this thing being able to make copies of itself is, like, fucked. Okay. Powers were right about the flames. They had enhanced the creature's power. Face your retreat with your cockroach. Cool. I feel like it's the kind of thing where the more times you do it, like, the more intense it becomes. Uh, I don't think I can get a second totem, right? So moving here and then depending on how this goes i go to the trapper or not wardrobe sliders yeah i got you buddy i just um i'm not sure how the puzzle works and i'm trying to just kind of figure all this this malarkey out what are we looking at here a mole and okay it's every the thing to the left and the right of it. Squirrel into bullfrog. Not there because I don't want to. Okay. So it basically gets to attack twice. It's crazy. Squirrel. Um, it has three health, so we're gonna play the squirrel. Then we're going to drop the wolf. And then we're going to play the stink bug, and then we're going to move to combat. Drop our deck. Got an adder. Combat. Draw 
off Arduck. Cockroach. Okay. You concede. No. Elk? Yeah, that's fine. Uh. Raw the squirrel. And then we want to play the adder. Yeah. Draw from our deck. Magpie? Okay. It does cost two to play, right? So the idea is that we give that up to something that's free and give it the search thing. Cockroach. And swing. I was hoping for more, but that's fine. We'll, we'll snag a pelt. Might as well, right? One rabbit pelt for free. One rabbit pelt, and then we go on our way. We got two two pelts. It's just a shame we couldn't get more. Okay, uh, magpie card, because I am actually curious how this works. Let's see. I don't know, just like put it on the stoat, I guess. Yeah, alright. Yeah, because that's, um, he now has flying and tutor, and he's one less, uh, cost, and he's a little bit more durable. We'll see if we win. Maybe, maybe not. And around you, you are not alone. I figure you're merged in the fog. Yep. Stand in the way of me, gold. Be darn. Okay, man. Fighters on that wardrobe, a bit like cards, but how to win? Easy, boss. Just pop that mule. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, we're good. Um. Oh. Um. Squirrel. Adder. Okay. Stink bug. Okay. And then combat, yeah. Let's go ahead and draw a squirrel. Play the squirrel. Let's use the stoat. Go ahead and grab. Go and grab the wolf. Move to combat. Excellent. Me mule, yeah. Yeah. Get messed up, my guy. Let's go and draw from the deck. Long horn, okay. Squirrel. And then we're gonna play this. Move to combat.
Oke. Okay. Um. Here. Don't draw a squirrel. No, I want the rattler. Move to combat. Okay, we're gonna draw from our deck. Squirrel. And then frog. More damage. Okay. Your lives are restored. Okay. Pick a rare card. Amoeba. Amorphous, its sigils are ever changing. Okay. Ace. The feral dog. Uh, but list. When a card bearing the sigil is played, a chime is created on each empty adjacent space. A chime is defined as power or zero power and one health. Okay. Hmm. I like this amoeba card. It seems interesting. So we'll, we'll roll with it. Read the prospector's unhinged gaze. Look ahead. Okay. Mm, oh, yes, I know. There, yeah, your boots, the tepid water invaded your nostrils. You have entered the wetlands. Okay. So before we get off of here. Um, oh. Oh, okay. I see. Gink? Okay. Uh, I forgot. I put that there very well. You may add it to your deck, and I'll do you one every so often. Alright, what are we looking at here? Okay, um... Is it just the bottom row? Give me a second here. Okay. Okay. 
Okay. I feel like I was close. Uh, let's see here. second this is just um it's just like a, a power thing Okay, what the fuck? Hmm. I don't actually know, that's crazy. Um, it's kind of nuts that I have to like move all of these. Oh. Uh, okay, hold on. Okay, uh... I was so close. Um, is it this one? Okay, hold on. Fucking there. Okay. Okay, so that needs to be in the middle. Got it. Worker ant and queen ant. Formidable creatures, those ants. Very well, I will add them to your deck and make them available for future challenges. Uh, A. Eh? Okay. Okay, so that can't move. That can. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh... Uh, 
I was real close uh, when this was down here. Maybe put that there. Got it. Caged wolf. Nice. Curious. Okay. Uh, what are we looking at here? Okay. Yeah. That was a box shit. Uh, okay. Back in here. Interesting. Okay, so that definitely needs to be up. That can't be moved. So close, okay. Now that needs to be up. can't be moved. So that one clearly needs to be up. Up, up. No. Yeah. I am just kind of guessing based off like the tiles I move. There we go. And I thought I had all the totem heads together. My thanks, the woodcarver will offer this now. The squirrel head. Huh. I wonder if I could just make the squirrels crazy broken. Alright, well I opened all of the cabinet pieces. The ultra and squirrel. Is that like my top deck or what? Does that just tell me what I'm gonna draw? Uh see here. Do. Ant spawner. When a card bearing the sigil is played, an ant is created in your hand. Okay. Amoeba. Skink. What do you do? Sigil will be struck. A tail is created in its place. Card bearing the sigil moves to the right. Okay. It's a bit crazy. All right, and that's going to do it, everybody. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you've enjoyed your time here today. Remember to hit that notification bell and tell your friends. We're trying to build a beautiful community here, and we cannot do so without you guys. Alexander, signing out.